know that UCP claimed that they'd set up a task force to talk about what could be done to help uh, downtown Calgary, yet that's turned into yet another uh, broken promise by the UCP. What was announced in yesterday's budget was an insulting afterthought. It represented 2% of what the city of Calgary was looking for. And, and you know, quite frankly, you know, why show up at all? Uh, you, the fact of the matter is, is that uh, uh, the people of the city and the people who understand how important uh, the city of, down, uh, of downtown Calgary is to uh, our economic renewal uh, need a provincial government that understands their role as partner, not a provincial government that, uh, that fobs it off on them saying, oh, it's your problem, not ours, catch you another time. That's what the UCP has on offer. It's not good enough. We know that businesses have been struggling and we've actually made a series of proposals over the last two years uh, for ways in which we could step up more effectively for small businesses, starting by actually getting the programs that this government has promised out the door to them. We have a whole bunch of programs that people still can't even access and now the government's talking about ending them. So uh, we, we, the government needs to step up for these small businesses. And you're also right about that contingency fund. That contingency fund was spent about four times uh, yesterday oh, in, in totality, four times over, depending which minister you talk to uh, when you ask them where the line item was for their actual uh, announcement at any given point. So the reality is, is there is no contingency for small businesses should we have uh, more, um, uh, more uh, challenges uh, confronting them as a result of uh, new variants in COVID. So it's not uh, uh, certainly not a plan that focuses on them. It also doesn't focus on tourism and supporting uh, more ways to diversify emerging uh, industries. The 4.5 plus billion dollar corporate handout that Jason Kenney gave on his pretty much first day in office doesn't help emerging businesses. It doesn't help small businesses. You have to be making a big profit before you get the benefit of that corporate tax uh, giveaway. And so there are no targeted plans there to help those smaller businesses. And that's what we're frustrated by because we have been calling for them for some time alongside many, many other uh, small business owners, entrepreneurs and job creators.